Okay. All right. All right. All right. We're trying this again. I don't know if it's on or not. And everybody give up on us. Well, if you can hear us, what's up? There's, yeah. People, and welcome to the Pop Stop. I'm Joey, and this is Bree Bree. Hopefully, your sound is working, guys. Please let us know. If, if somebody's not, on, can you tell us, is our. Oh, yay! It's working. Is it too loud? Because he tends to be really I'm very loud. loud. I, I will talk. Oh, what's up, Good Antonio? Sound. And it is George Flores. Yeah! What's up, everybody? And how was your. SDCC shopping? Your summer convention exclusive shoppings. Did any of y'all do. Uh, get what you wanted. Anybody miss something? Okay, Antonio goes, Joey, you're loud, bro. Here, I'll move the microphone by me. And Alexis is here too. Hi, Alexis. Hi, guys. Okay, I'll try to talk a little bit quiet. Quiet here. I like both. I like. I like. I like your shirt. I Moaning Myrtle. It. We actually missed her. Yeah. I can't even describe why we missed her. I think no, we that just, was my fault. I it was, was kind of an oversight. I was at Hot Topic. I was first in line, and I went in there, and I was thinking, I was grabbing, grabbing, and my hands got full, and I was like, okay, I think this is it, and then I, I just forgot the Moaning Myrtle. Missed Peppy Le Pew. So at our Barnes and Noble. Uh, our chat just disappeared. What? Yeah, I'm not exactly sure what happened, but at our Barnes and Noble. Um, there was how many Pepe Le Pew total? There's probably about 15, 16, 18. And that was the first one that was gone. Absolutely. Uh, why, why does it keep disappearing? Our chat is just like disappearing. No, well, it's popping up. It's, sure. it's, it's, uh... RIP chat. <laughs> <laughs> no, not RIP chat yet. What's up, David? What's up, Thomas? Hey, no, Thomas is the one that said RIP chat, not what's up to you. Yeah, <laughs> it's just blinking. So if we miss what you're saying, just say it a whole bunch of times. And All right, we got a, uh, let's see, what do you think of the gold Marvel Pops? <sighs> well, I, I will say this. The gold chrome effect that they use on the Pops is very nice or the like yeah any and all the chrome pops look really nice i don't know i think it's kind of they're but... kind of taking away the the awesomeness of the chrome i yeah. mean of course we're probably going to buy at least a few of them but i think they're kind of overdoing it just a bit something said it's on delay mode i have no idea what that means we're on delay mode are we delayed are hmm. our lips not sunk synced well we have really crappy internet where we're at so yeah that might be it too we live out in the boondocks so <laughs> You're in San Diego right now? Oh, my God. Hey, well, okay, we'll take one metallic waist yeah, and one golden Brandon, Vegeta. And then we'll just meet you at Fan Expo next year. Yeah. We go every year. So we'll just meet up there. Going back to Hogwarts, I need Cap, Thor, and Loki gold. Yeah, those are good ones. Fifty people? Uh, yeah, like Hot Topic was ridiculous. I was first in line, and there were so many people behind me, and probably the first 12 people got Brawly, and nobody else. I was like, Duh! oh, flippers. So, Antonio said the chat is on delay mode. Uh, I mean, is that something I need to change, or are we just seeing things really, really late? Maybe we're slow. Hold leaders. on, hold on, George Flores. I miss Brawly, and some D bag ripped a Yamcha out of my hands because oh, he wanted five. Oh, no, that is. The flippers were out today. Like, they were crazy. Uh, there was one guy in front of Barnes & Noble. I had just finished with Think Geek, and then there was this guy waiting. I was by the second door, and he was asking me, he's like, hey, which ones are you going to get? And I'm like, uh, I'm going to get a Pepe Le Pew and, and an Ant-Man for sure. He goes, okay, cool. I need those two characters. Get me as many as you can. I'm like, no. Uh, he, then I heard him on the phone. He asked me, Hey, is the Super Saiyan uh, character here? I was like, uh, that's at Hot Topic, and you just missed, and they sold out. And he was so mad. So, that's yeah, flippers. Did we get any Overwatch pops? We got uh, 76. We got Soldier 76, yes. And his little little chilling and grilling outfit. Chilling and grilling outfit. But Somebody's been watching too much Bobby Flay. <laughs> there might be some overwatch in our next giveaway so be sure to go into our comments down below not the comments the description and sign up for our giveaway it's gaming themed yeah so also guys um so one reason i guess we kind of decided to do this live stream too is because we actually went back 
after all the chaos and a big long nap, long nap, we went back to where all did we go? Actually, Hot topic. Thing. She took a nap. I took a small nap, and then I went oh, out pop shopping whatever. again. Whatever. You took I found a nap out, too. I found out that they released uh, My Hero Academia series two today. So. Oh yeah. So we had to go out for that. Um, so anyways, we did go out. We went back to the same stores we were at this morning. We went back to Think Geek, uh, three different game stops, Barnes and Noble, and is that every oh and Hot Topic. And they still had a lot of stuff, surprisingly. Not Hot Topic. Well, no, well, and not Barnes and Noble. Yeah, uh, but Think Geek and Think Geek had everything, GameStop and they had plenty of it. And so they, like the guy was like, Man, is this all you have? He's like, No, we still got more in the back. I was like, oh. All right. So if you guys are looking for them and you happen to miss them, if you're looking for something from GameStop or from Think Geek, like you probably still stand a chance at those. Barnes, I think you're going to be out of luck. Yeah, Bill, our Barnes only had a limit of two per person also. Uh, and that guy wanted me to fill the limit. He's like, well, can you get your girl to get some for me nope. too? I was like, no, we're getting like one of each, each character and not even a piece. Like, well, we I didn't let, even get one of each character. We just got one of what we Yeah, wanted. we got one of what we wanted. I grabbed them. I put them in her hands. She went and paid, and that was it. I could have grabbed. I was the first one to hit the table yeah. because they opened our doors first. Like your, No, your door. You were the only person I, standing at that door. I had an entire line so that was actually, me. Funny story about that is that guy was waiting there, and he was just like hounding me, and I heard him on the phone. They are trying to hit so many different locations. And he goes, is this, why are people waiting over there? I go, usually that door opens up first. <laughs> I go, you're master player. He's like, is that girl with you? I go, yeah, that girl's with me. She's waiting over here. Yeah, I'm, that girl. I said, I'm over here for a contingency plan just in case. So right when it was getting close to nine, he walked off and then got in front of her. Didn't he like elbow you out of the way? Uh, he, no, he just like basically slid past me like this and like, yeah, knocked me out of the way. It was. Funny thing is they opened the door where I was the only one standing first and I just started running in there, and the guy in uh, Barnes was like, "We got a runner." So then I started power walking. Yeah, and, but uh, his legs are like giant, so like three steps, and he was already there. So I got to the table first, and then I just grabbed what I wanted. And I was like, "Oh!" And then I see her just like, doo -doo 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 -doo, and I gave her what's up. I think the name is Plex Trucks. I could not agree more. I actually said this in our haul video. I think five is a ridiculous amount. I mean, I understand like splitting up, getting pops like with friends at different places. We've done that before too. Like, hey, I'm gonna get this. What do you want? You know, whatever. But five, five is a little bit ridiculous. I think three maybe should be like the maximum. Yeah, three is three's pretty good. I think two is a good number, but you know, just in the off chance that you're actually picking stuff up for people. But you know, we've been like we <laughs> we actually uh, like kind of ran into some people at our target that were doing the same thing. And then they were like trying to feed us some bull about, well, I like to have one in the box and one out of the box. And then I get him for my son who he has one in the box and one out of the box. I like, just no, just your flipper. Like, yeah, that flipper today is like, well, I'm going to get one for my son. I was like, yeah, I got to get one for my son too. Even though I don't have one. No, <laughs> you have a son. We have Daisy. Daisy. So it's the long awaited red hood pop. What do you people think of this? I've been waiting for this for a long time, so much so that I made one myself. So there's my Red Hood compared to the actual Red Hood pop, and their body is great. Yeah. I like my head, my shiny head a little bit better, but head. ooh, shiny is, is... Yeah, honestly, I don't know. What's up, Jetta Patrol? Where's Digby? Digby had to work today. Digby's sleeping. Yeah. We actually tried to get him to go shopping with us, but he didn't go. Oh, uh, let's see. I fell asleep at 2.45. Did you get oh, all of no. the... Oh, Oh, sorry. We're, we're like talking... You're fine. Go for it. Okay, I'm going to go with this. Did you get all the Conan Pops? Funny you said that because I got some of them. We have... Actually, I have it right here. I got this one originally in our first haul, and then when we went back later, I got this one. I was trying to buy the regular one, and... Um, uh, like, there was one there, and then the guy was trying to check me out at GameStop. He goes, well, this one's on reserve. I can't sell it to you, so... Eh. Yeah. Then we went to Think Geek, and the guy mm. said there was a ton of them in the back. So yeah, he was basically like, because like Joey was like, "Well, should I get it or whatever?" And the guy's like, "To be honest with you, we have a ton in the back, so I, I wouldn't be." Yes, I, <laughs> And also, Nate, I am aware that their body is awesome. No, it is actually and the boots. 
Yeah, no, I mean, this one is just a fin body that I painted, so I, I completely agree with that. But I do like the shape of the, the mask better on mine rather than this. This one's You mean kind of, Deathstroke's mask? Yeah, the Deathstroke's mask, <laughs> but it looks fiercer, and yeah. I think this is a little nicer. I kind of think they went a little too subtle with, like, the actual lines on it. Like, I kind of wish these were a little bit more pronounced on this actual But if I, if I get my hands on another one, which my buddy actually bought one that I think he's going to give to me because... He ordered one online, but he thought it was going to get canceled. So then he got one in store. So anyway, I'm going to paint one to where this is going to be candy, shiny, red. red. And who um, knows? I might give it away. So you know what we need after that is we need like the really cheesy red hood. Oh, no. Yes, no. we do. Come on. You no. know you would buy it. No, I would, I you would, would buy it. You would absolutely buy it. I would buy it, but no. <laughs> Whatever. All right. Let's see. Not too much of a DC fan. That Brawly, though. The Brawly. This Brawly, this is a really nice pop. Look at this guy. But could he take on this guy? Look how much bigger All Might is than Brawly. As it should be. Who would win in this fight? Wow. Well. Hey, no spoilers or anything like that. I'm still going to go with, uh, I don't know. But this figure is absolutely amazing. Let's see. First person in line at my GameStop bought every Conan. What, what a piece of... Wow. Let's see. That's, mm. but I'm sure he had so many friends that he was buying them all for, right? And small little children. The new My Hero Academia pops are amazing. Oh, I, are they? Yeah, go ahead. We grabbed one out. Probably my favorite one. I'm waiting for the Hot Topic exclusive. We're giving exclusive. spoilers because we're probably going to do a video on oh, these. This guy is beautiful. I love the character. Show it to Aizawa. I raise head. Oh, I had to get him, and we got quite a few. I'm actually thinking I'm gonna try to do a. We're gonna try to do a video soon of those and put that out. And I'm gonna try to put actual editing work into that one. I've been lazy yeah. lately. Yeah. See, where did you find the new My Hero Academia wave? We found it at mostly uh, at Think Geek and then um, at GameStop. Yeah, and then it actually took us two different GameStops to try to find. Um, but yeah, Think Geek GameStop. That's where we've had the most luck. You guys don't like Mezco 112s? I actually do. They're kind of expensive, and they're a little small for the price. Editing is overrated. Uh, <laughs> That's what we do on a daily basis. Yeah, we're, we're both video editors so for a living, actually. We, we kind of get lazy when it comes to our own stuff. But as far as the 112s, I do have a few, and I've been waiting to put my Deathstroke one to do an episode. But I, like, she did some stop-motion animation for that. We have just had, oh Deathstroke yeah we've been so busy oh it was such a pain too because he kept falling over and I was like eh. but um yeah I do like them they're just a little bit pricey so we might do more uh in the future we might actually do some is there something else like anything else like that you guys would like to see I mean obviously Funko Pops we've kind of gotten the bag but um <laughs> any other types of figures that we don't necessarily do all the time that y'all would like to see okay any word on the Pikachu pop okay. Um, so the Pikachu pop, I know a lot of people that don't like the way it looks, but I heard that they're making like 50 something thousand. They're making a lot of them. Yeah, so I know. It's like 52, I don't think it's going to be hard 000, to get. Supposedly. But, you know, Target is one of those things that it's now, sometimes really crappy to have Target. Exclusives. I'm just waiting for the Gengar pop. I mean, Gengar. yeah. Or the Diglett pop. Yeah. The Diglett pop? Like, that's what you pull out? <laughs> if anything, they're going to start, of course, with, like, Pikachu, Squirtle. I think it's going to be like Pokemon Go, and every time we go to the store, all we're going to see is Rattata and, and some and Pidgeys. Pidgeys. Let's see. Thoughts on Funko 5 Star figures? Good question, Alex Lopez. Sorry if you've already answered this question. Just join. Well, happy to have you. We have not answered it. <laughs> I'm on the fence. I mean, there's so many things. There's vinyls. There's dorbs. There's other stuff. Um, they're, I don't know. There's nothing not, like they haven't really struck my fancy, if you will, at first. Have you seen them? The what? The one? five stars? I was totally like reading and I kind of zoned out. <laughs> Sorry. I'm on the fence about them. I'm still on the fence about vinyls. There's some that I really like. I really got to see them in person because that's what sells me. I had vinyls first. I didn't like them. Oh yeah. And then when I saw them in, in person, person, I was like, okay, here's my money. So yeah. that's going to be one that I want to see them in person, which I have not yet. And I'll decide, decide if I like then. them or not. Uh, you had a, a few people that actually were like, look, Diglett, Thomas. Yeah. Thomas Mattis is on your side. Diglett so. pop would be amazing. <laughs> you have supporters. Digby or Diglett. Uh, no, no, either both. I might no, actually, neither. I attempted to make a Digby pop once. 
Uh, I think he's like, yeah, disassembled in different pieces. How I want actual Digby to be. Uh, no, I'm just joking. <laughs> uh, probably won't have Pikachu in Canada. Uh, he might not like the cold. Uh, with the pull. <laughs> not answering that one. 10 inch Diglett? Hey, that could be used for multi purpose. Never mind. Okay, this, getting off track. Getting this off went track. downhill fast. Any luck on the Toy Tokyo Pops? No, we have, haven't had any luck. There's uh, quite a few that we want from there. The Heavy Metal Pop for sure. And of course, the Gold Vegeta, which I do want that Gold Pop. Oh. We're getting all our Gold Marvels, but I won't get my Gold Vegeta. Yeah, that one is going to be a little bit ridiculous. Toy Tokyo is going to be what? Difficult. Okay, what pop is the most wanted on your list for Comic Con? Uh, I'm gonna go with Weiss, Metallic Weiss. Well, yes, absolutely, yes. I love the character. I love Weiss and Beerus. I don't have the Metallic Beerus, but I have the regular Beerus. But so I what think you're saying looks... is, is both of those are on your own list? The one from last year and the one from this year. Oh, if we're going for like uh, old school ones, then I have yeah. a lot more. Um, no, I think the Metallic Weiss looks fantastic, and that one is definitely up there. Oh, somebody's salty. Prince Pablo's salty. They didn't get Pepe Le Pew. Yeah, Pepe Le Pew is hard to get. I will tell you, you should grab that Pepe Le Pew. So why did you... Grab it, grab it, grab Pepe it. Le Pew? Okay. Yeah. i got to answer another question. Me ah! too. And knocking everything over. Well, we so have... somebody goes, so why did your video slow down? Uh, what, do you, what do you mean? Wait, is that like because you're lazy? Because <laughs> uh, we actually get really busy. Okay. I'm not trying to be a jerk and rub it in your face, but I really like the sculpt on this guy and I love the way his tail is done. So I had to show you because when I took it out to do uh, the 360s, I was like, wow, his shape is great. If this was flocked. Hold on, enough about that. If this was flocked, it would be like. They, they probably will come out with a yeah, flocked one. No amazing. One they, this might be totally unrelated, but did you guys see the new Dragon Ball Super Broly trailer? Yes, we did. And yes, <laughs> I do hope they come out with a pop. They can take my money. Was that loud? Is that loud? The mic? I need oh, yeah. I forgot the mic is like right here. Whoops. You knifed that box. The box is no, okay. Oh, I have a technique. Oh, my gosh. She's professional. I'm responsible. You get it? Yes, we are getting the Hush Batman pop. R.I.P. box. Man, you... You guys are cruel. No, okay. I have a technique that opens the boxes flawlessly. So let's see. I'm not careless. Oops. Putting them in is a different story. Did not see the Teen Titan trailer. Is it? Are you talking about the animated one or the actual live action? What do you want, Jake? Jake's talking right now. You want it? Oh, he wants to see Brawley. Really? You're interrupting our live stream for that? I'm <laughs> kicking you out. He's smiling at the same time. Uh. He's like a little child. <laughs> Let's see. The employees took all the pops except one Ant Man, but thankfully I was first and could get him. Wait, at Barnes? That's lame. At Barnes, where? That's super lame. Uh, just leave him there so you can see just this hair. Hey, people, more like on this. Hey, people, more like on this live feed. It's only 25 likes. Yeah, people. That 26 yeah. now. Come on, let's get those likes up. Maybe we'll do this again if the likes go Aww. past. Hey, we 40. have 69 people watching. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> what? All right, so let's talk about Clone Wars already. More surprises coming soon, and I know about it. Okay, what are your surprises? Who said that? This stuff is going way too fast for me to read. See, big surprises. Oh. And I know about it. Oh. Open invite to Sunday night pops any of the week you're free. Oh. Hey. What? Wait, open invite to Sunday Night Pops. He should message us. Yeah. Let's see what's up. Okay. Uh, 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 um. 69. Uh. All, right. All right. I want to talk about something not SDCC. Uh, the Metallic Sonic that came out with the shirt. Has anybody uh. had any luck with that? I cannot find it, okay. but I want, to, I want to compare him to my Metallic. This is mine that I, I made. So and a the while one back, looks really good. Uh, we released a video... That was the um, painting, repainting of the tick, which was quite a while ago. And at the same time, he painted this guy. But I don't think we ever posted him, did we? No, uh, I don't. I don't know. I'm not maybe. sure if we painted or po posted him. But um, at the same time, he did the tick. He painted this guy, and then he saw that they were coming out with the um, metallic Sonic that looks Antonio, just like this. You found him, man. What? Wait, Timmy found him at the Rosenberg GameStop. What? That's our GameStop. Yeah, they said they sold out by the time I got there. Boo. Don't be telling people where we're from. We're not from Rosenberg. I just said local GameStop. Mm -hmm. 
He's a darker blue, but that's the only difference. Hmm. We really do. Like side by side compare. You just want proof that your paint is nicer. No, I, I actually thought theirs was very nice. I want to see it in person. No, but uh yeah. What's up, tiny, AJ? Though, Come on. Hmm. We got you into collecting with your girlfriend. I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, I hope you enjoy it, but I'm sorry. When I get a girlfriend, time. I want to collect with yeah, her, too. Yeah, you should. Yeah, that'd be great. <laughs> Let's see. What is AJ? Lexus, I wonder if they just put a comment after comment if they'll notice or if the comment, a really long comment, if they look and notice. Hmm. That sounds like AJ. <laughs> Definitely sounds like him. Oh, okay. Come on. We're taking questions now. Dude, come to San Diego. You buying? We'll be on the next flight. Uh, we might try to go next year. We would love to go. Five years from now. It's just expensive and expensive. <laughs> it is very expensive, but I really want to go. I heard it's super crowded and you have to wait in a lot of lines. What so. was your first pop? First pop, the um, Avengers, uh, Iron Man from Avengers. We found it at Walgreens. Yeah, and I, I bought it for like seven bucks. I don't know where he is. He's not anywhere you're going to find him. Uh, okay. It I know be. where all the pops are. Because you're like Rain Man of hey. Funko Pops. She's like, how do you know this stuff? I was like, I don't even know how I know this stuff. Yeah. It's a curse. It's kind of crazy because I told him, I said, the day that we're going to slow down on buying pops is the time, like when we accidentally buy the same one twice. And so far that hasn't happened because this guy has like a ridiculous... Oh, Mind yeah. for all of that stuff. All right, here's got here's a good question. Nate Warner says, uh, "What got y'all into collecting? Period. We never collect period. I had Funko Pops? Question mark. Wait, uh, like in general yeah. or pops? So I was a kid of the '90s. I had a pretty wicked Beanie Baby collection. <laughs> <laughs> I even had like the McDonald's. McDonald's had like exclusive ones for like July Fourth, and I still have those in the package." Um, I used to collect like the little collectible shoes too that are very similar to like the cryptozoic ones that they have now. I have, like a collection so of those. Um hmm. trying to think of what else I yes, I know you collected way more stuff. That's why I just started. Because after that, like it wouldn't even okay, go for it. Yeah. No, I'm just no, letting you talk. No, whatever, whatever. Uh so I collect pops. No, I actually started collecting uh comic books when I was six. And that got me into action figures and then Power Rangers, Ninja Turtles, a little bit of Ghostbusters, lots of X-Men, Batman. And then we kind of stumbled across Pops. Uh, we were actually buying a birthday present for one of our friends. And I was like, oh, these things are dopey, but cool. I kind of like them. And uh, they just had so many licenses. And that's actually why they are so wildly popular is because they get all these licenses from things that you would never, never, see. never see or like like what's the point of having that but you're like holy crap that's awesome i don't yeah. have any merchandise from my favorite movie or show and that kind of what uh is what hooked us also uh the collectability especially in the beginning oh, uh yeah. it was like well a, not in the very beginning but in the beginning of it starting to get popular yeah well we kind of got in right before it got like really popular uh we've been doing this oh yeah we used to be able to find four or five years now we used to be able to find some really really good stuff out in the wild for retail and then but it was just try it was fun finding the ones that were a little like golden on. girls i was thinking that in my brain i just didn't say it Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> anyway so that's kind of what the thrill of the hunt got us into it it's not as fun hunting for pops anymore i will say that today we had a great time but we also like paid for it literally. Like we both took off days of work. We woke up at four o'clock. No, yeah, we waited no, for you hours. woke up at four o'clock. My alarm was set for four like fifty, and at four o'clock he decides to have like a full conversation with me, and I was just like, I don't care. I want to sleep. And he was like, But people are already lining up. I saw it online. We gotta go. And she is like, not Ugh. a morning person no. at all. <laughs> nope. All right, what? Somebody uh, asked how many pops we have. To be completely honest with you, I have no idea. We don't count. Do you even have a ballpark figure? How many pops we have? I think... Uh, I don't want to know, I don't think. 
I think we're, I think we have about 700. Then we have to admit we have a problem. Because uh, we started, we actually had more than that, but we started like fine tuning what we're collecting. And we also get sent some pops from uh, like when we, you know, out of, out of boxes. Subscription boxes we and stuff, stuff that we would just basically give away. People always come over to our house and we're like, what are you into? Because we have so much stuff. <laughs> like, you want to take it? Take it. But Take we, it off. Like here, you can see a little bit up. There's all, those are probably about five deep. And then we have pops all along the side of here. We're not in that big of a room here, but uh, we probably, I would say we're about 700. Favorite pop from SDCC, like favorite one that we got? Actually, favorite one overall. Uh, Man, that's really difficult because. I'm going to go with this guy. Okay. I, I really like him. It's a totally new sculpt and everything. It's done really well. Uh, you know, I was second place would have to be Pepe Le Pew. I think Pepe is probably my favorite, but man, that's really hard because there's a lot of them that when I took out, I was like, "Wow, these are done really nice." The runner then, up is this guy, and then there's that Look guy. How goofy he um, looks! I love it. I'm trying to think. So the nearly headless Nick glows fantastically. Hold um, on. I think he looks really, really cool. We'll post a picture on our Instagram. Ooh. Hold on. Ever collect Mighty Mugs? Digby loves Mighty Mugs. Uh, we have two of them. We don't, we never really Actually, got into them. Actually, we took them to work. Yeah, we have two of them and they're at work. And Digby kind of, we work with Digby too. And he kind of places them all over the place and, you know, plays with them instead of working. Um, But yeah. What's up, know. Jay? Oh, Jay, what's, it's been a long oh, time. Jay. Hi. My Canadian brother. Yay. It's been too long. What's your favorite sign pop? That would have to be the Signed? sign. Yes, that would have to be my sign. Aww. Destro that Jay got me. Look Jay, at that, right behind perfect me. Perfect timing. Yeah. Um, probably my favorite one, which I do How's not Mix doing? have behind me, is uh, the one that I got signed. Uh, the Destro that was signed by Manu Bennett. If I can talk, that'd be great. But um, I don't know where he is. But well, yeah, that one even has my name on it too. So that one's really special to me. Do you collect Marvel Legends? Yes, actually, we have quite a few of them. Oh, Mix is good. Glad Mix. to hear it. <laughs> well, it, she's good. Ah, oh yeah, it, it, go check out Mix's new page. She's doing a lot of effects makeup. Uh, maybe oh, Jay will post a link down hold below. On. Okay, I feel like <laughs> Jake's name might be Mighty Marvel Twenty Three. <laughs> he said, "Hi guys, will you ever do a Hot Toys review? I'm a Hot Toys collector myself." Hot Show toys. your Hot Toys collection. Do any of y'all are any of y'all interested in seeing Hot Toys? We have a lot of Hot Toys. He just said he is. Other than or that, she. other than than that person, I'm asking the rest of the group, Brie. Yeah, we Brie. have a ton of Hot Toys. We actually shot some really cool stop motion for the Hulkbuster Hot Toy, um, and we just haven't gotten around to putting the video together. <laughs> So we... first live stream you caught from you guys because this is our first live stream. Yeah, you have great timing. L yes, show hot toys. Your name is Logan. Hi, Logan. Jake, bring us a hot toy. <laughs> Let's see if Jake will bring us a hot toy. So our roommate is a huge collector, and it kind of, it kind of sucks because we're all a huge collectors. So our house is like loaded with collectibles. He's big into hot toys. He was big into pops, but he kind of quit the pop game to get into hot toys. And he's gonna have gone crazy, but like we have so much stuff that comes in, like our collections are like merging. And then there's Breebe's corner of her little collections, and he's even overtaken that. He's even overtaken Breebe's Harley Quinn Wonder Woman shelf because he I put have a, other things on there, but he put a Harley Quinn hot toy on there. Yeah, uh, that's, that's true, 100% true. Let's see. A pop I want to see made that doesn't exist yet. Oh, that's tough. I used to have so many good answers for that, and then Funko's been slowly making them all. Uh, tell let me, me think about that. I'll get back to you. Tell me the story behind why you had and how you had Paul Wall in your channel. We had Paul Wall on the channel? Had Paul Wall. Hmm. Our friend is really good friends with Paul Wall, so we've met him multiple times. Oh, maybe we posted like a picture with Paul. And, yeah, there's a picture of us, and he's a super nice guy. I love Paul Wall. Houston. We represent. actually went to one of his. Oh, 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 I feel like a QVC or something. Oh my gosh, this guy is heavy. Oh look, we got. Oh look, we, we have, have a hot toy. We have a hot toy. This is uh, Iron Man from Spider-Man: Homecoming. Check that out. We got Bony Stark here. 
That's, oh. that's not it. Look at that. He looks all super nice. Yeah, I don't know where all the controls are on I don't this wanna, I don't want to break it. Just take them off. So I don't know. Guy, I still think this guy's so better. This guy is actually, it's actually metal because some of the Iron Man figures are plastic and some of them are done in metal. Die cast. His, yeah, his legs are die cast. I think his arms are plastic, right? But look at look at that face. But he's heavy. He's got look some that face. really it's, good It's like we got RDJ him. right here in the in, on set with us. Yeah. And he is heavy. Is this your newest one or one of your newest ones? It's just one that he had just laying just one, out back. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah, got all the hot well, toys. Okay, we'll have to take a picture because he has an entire. Uh, we'll, we'll post pictures of that on our Instagram. If you do not follow us on Instagram, it is at Original Pop Stop. I, I don't know. All right. Uh, why is Digby never in videos? No because more. Because we invite him all the time and he never shows up. Digby is very busy no, these days. Busy. Uh, basically, uh, we work kind of far away and we all work together. We see Digby every every day. And uh, on the weekends, he uh, that's his only free time. And actually, I think he works too. Uh, so he will be in videos in the future. It's just right now our schedules have not been meeting up. We tried to get him to go STCC shopping with us. He said he would come, but I didn't want him to take off of yeah. work. And that would be three people from our work going shopping. So so there'd be nobody left over. Yeah, there'd, there'd be nobody there. I kept getting videos today from our coworkers. Like, people were sitting at my desk and his desk impersonating us, and they were, like, sending us the videos. <laughs> so, Let's yeah. see. I get my Gladiator Hulk hot toy next week. Would love to see your guys' collections. Do you want to see hot toys? Ugh. Uh, how many hot toys are in this house? About 25? Almost 50? You need to calm down. <laughs> Like, seriously, you, you need to go to Hot Toys hey, Addiction Center. Okay, so somebody just asked, are you going to make any more skit videos? It's funny because we were just talking about this. He has a skit idea for My Hero Academia, and we just bought a bunch of those pop spoilers. Um, so we were actually thinking about it. It's just I time is... My favorite part of this channel was doing uh, sketches and skits. Like, I don't know. It's just really fun, and we got to be creative with the uh, video work. So I hope we get time to do more, but... Like YouTube is a, is, a, is a rough world. It's just like you got to just produce, produce, produce. And sometimes yeah. we get, you know, rolled over by um, it. So Nate Warner, so it says, says, can you really talk about needing to slow down, Joey? I mean, anyway, did you watch the video that we did today? Because you could have bought like a hot toy and a half with that. Mm. Let's see. David Rodriguez Jr., what's up? Yes, we are live. Awesome. Love your channel. Oh, wait. Oh, thank you. He said hi to you, so say hi, buddy. Oh, hi. I don't know which one you're looking at. Uh, one of them. All right. What was your so first? So what do we do for a living? We already answered that, but basically we edit videos. Well, I... Not our videos. <laughs> our videos don't pay enough. But so we are both uh, video editors. I am also a music producer and video editor. Oh, so yeah, I, I, cre that. I create songs for a living and then also create videos. So that's why sometimes it's very hard for us You're to get really our, lazy our videos out because we literally edit videos all day long. Get out of here with that. You keep on interrupting our stuff. <sighs> I don't mind. You can't live with collectors because they just want, want to get more to Cuphead Pops. That is entirely true. We are still working on those mystery minis, and boy, oh, boy, they are becoming a pain in the butt. Are you guys fans of WWE? <laughs> slow jams. Yes, that's the type of music producer he is, slow jams. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> no. We are fans of WWE, but we are very selective with which ones we get. We really don't have that many, and we really don't try to buy that many uh digby on the other hand is a huge fan and he has a pretty decent collection he loves his uh cm punk so yeah his cm punk and he is looking for a rock chase right now so i'm trying to find a rock chase for digby uh what's the next harry potter pops you want and you guys should do live streams more often thank you i think does that mean we're doing an okay job where can i get a brie brie pop okay we're still working on the mold uh <laughs> I actually thought about making one, but uh, I was gonna get but, uh, I was gonna get the Baywatch Pamela Anderson, take uh -huh. off the head, and put on the head of Brave. And then there Her you parts go. on the wrong side, though. I'll have to start parting my hair on the opposite. Yeah, side. yeah, yeah. Adjust to the pop so I don't have to sculpt. Uh, oh, actually, you just got the rock pop. Well done. Um, do we have a link to the custom pops? Custom. Wait, what? Do you have a link to order 
what are custom? I don't know. I okay, as far as custom, <laughs> okay, so our custom pops, I do make custom pops, and usually it's very rare, uh, but we do put them up for sale. A well, lot of times we just give them away. We do put a lot of them in the giveaways because uh, I really don't make that many. But we are going to do some, uh, like a, a few of the ones that I have just done. We're going to do a video, and then I am going to put them up on eBay uh, at like $9, and then, you know, y'all bet on them, you know. Whatever they sell for, they sell for. And that's what we are going to do. I don't know exactly when, but hopefully sometime soon. And yeah, and that money will go to be fun making more videos. <laughs> sure. What he said. What? Mm -mm -mm. What video game are you excited for that's... Coming out? Um. Okay, so I know this is like really ridiculous and everybody's going to hate me for this, but I'm actually really excited for the new Mario Party game. <laughs> Everybody hates that game and I love it. I used, I played the first one on Smash 64. Brothers is what you should have said. Well, Smash Brothers, uh, the addition Cuphead. to Cuphead. Cuphead DLC. Definitely. Um, yeah, but I'm actually really excited about Mario Party. I'm not going to lie. I like that game. <laughs> Has Toy Toki even went live with their exclusive yet? Not that I'm aware of, but I've been pretty tired. Uh, uh, no, well, I haven't seen anything about Toy Tokyo. <laughs> but that one's probably going to be pretty tough. And what about Entertainment Earth? Did you guys get anything from Entertainment Earth? Because their site was locked up, like, all day today. But we finally got through. I think we got through. Hopefully. But hopefully we don't get canceled because I do want my and, ball penguin. And we did order a couple things from them. But their website was awful today. Hey, look, somebody else loves Mario Party. So now, what's on the front of my shirt? It's Deadpool with tacos. Taco, I see. Taco, what, tacos. I see what you did there. <laughs> uh, did I buy the Funko cereal? I really wanted the uh, the Cuphead ones, and we were there today. But both the boxes that they had were completely crunched up. I was like, so I yeah. passed on them. Well, um, how many did they have when you went in the first time? I didn't look. They were in that back corner. I think there was three because the girl in front of me bought one, and then I saw it, and I was like, uh, I need to get to Think Geek, so I just passed. Did on. they move them to the back corner? I don't know. Well, no, we. I don't know. Know. Okay, I was just asking where they were. I wasn't there in the morning. I was. Okay. Do you play Fortnite? <sighs> no. Uh, <laughs> tried. Tried. Failed. Yeah. Yeah. I was doing fine until somebody just built something in front of me and then I died. And I was like, I'm done. <laughs> I'm terrible. It's gamer logic. There I'm doesn't terrible. have to be logic. I'm terrible at video games, by the way. I'm like, I can't do it. Like, I, I, I love playing them, but hey, I'm just terrible. Hey, I have at least one party person on my Mario Party side, so... Don't fight. We're not going to fight. We don't fight. Well, you see. Don't, oh, don't fight, guys. <laughs> Worst case of a flipper that we saw today. Uh, Wait, today? Yeah. We saw a few, like, you can just spot them in the lines because they're like, they come up, they look through the window before the doors open, they're counting all the pops, they're trying to see, they count the people in the line. There's like, they even, there's some people that even will they come were up. on their phones with each other talking to each other because I could like see them talking to each other and I'm just like, oh. But I love brother. the one guy. So the one flipper today, the same one that was there. He they saw, were in a group of three. There was three of them total though. It wasn't just that guy. It was two other guys too. So he, he saw me walking with the Hot Topic and Think Geek Bag and I was going to the trunk to put it in. Uh, and he's like, he's like, hey, what's up? what do you have in there? I was like, Oh, just collectibles. And he goes, wait, I thought they're not opening till, till 10. I was like, well, that's because you're a flipper and you don't go into the local groups and find out that the stores actually open early. I guess this was his first year doing it. He actually got there at three o'clock in the morning. We saw their car before that. And he was waiting at Barnes and Noble the whole time, not knowing that uh, Hot Topic and Think Geek opened up uh, early at eight and eight thirty. Um, no, I think uh, it was like eight fifteen and eight. Oh no, and eight it, and eight thirty. You're right. You're but right. anyway, he was like, "Well, do you think they have any of the Super Saiyan pop left?" I was like, "Nah, man, he's gone. He's gone." Yeah. So he was all really mad. It was kind of funny. I I laughed on the inside, and then when he walked away, I laughed on the outside. <laughs> no, and then when they opened your door first, you were like, "Ha." Uh, somebody asked if we're dating. I just would like to say only when he behaves himself. <laughs> right? Right? Uh, right? 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 A voice of the last 10 years of my life. Huh. Um, let's see. Oh, I like all the little dolphins, flippers. Oh, nice. <laughs> What's up, Anthony? It's perfect. 
Uh, okay, here we go. AJ, well, I, I've been reading your stuff, but I just don't want to respond to you. Uh, He's on the side of the chat, so I'm having to strain harder. Sorry. Want footage from Toy Tokyo in New York. I'm going next week. Yes, Anto uh, Ant Antonio. <laughs> yes, AJ. We would love some footage. Let us know what you get. Maybe we'll throw something together, bring you on the show when you come back, and uh, buy me some stuff, too. That's and awesome. By the way, um, I'm kind of jealous. Flippers. Take me with you. Flip I'll, I'll pack in oh, your little carry-on. Here's a little serious thing. Flippers are the reason I got out of Pops. It used to be really fine, funny <sighs> stuff uh, in the wild instead of just trying to fist fighting people at night. This is so true. I mean, it's really been rough on us. We've thought about quitting before, too, just because that it's not fun anymore. I mean, there was a, a guy there that we know is a known flipper. He knows us, too. And, like, we were trying to, like, not see him. He is the reason there's no chases in our area because he knows all the trucks, their schedules, and he has nothing better to do at this time than to be and he, i mean he like he'll have the employees unload the truck and wait for them no uh, it's, to pick it's out terrible. The it, it just makes it it's not fun i mean collectibles are supposed to be fun and these people just trying to it's hot so yeah they want to make money and stuff like that <laughs> wow antonio really <laughs> antonio aj i get them confused all the they time start with the same letter kind yeah of. uh but it does hurt it has but then i thought you know what i'm just gonna get what i can uh, I'm going to collect what I like. I'm going to focus what we're focusing, what we really want to collect as far as pops. We're not going all over the place sometimes. I'm cutting back actually on Star Wars. Uh, that's uh, the Star one. Wars, we gave up on trying to complete that's anything we, in that That's series. what we chose on, on cutting back. So you just got to, you know, you got to kind of not let flippers ruin it for you, even though it's really hard. Just take what you can get. Hi from Jiminy Crickets. Hi from Texas. Hi, we're from Texas too. That's crazy. That's why they said too. They said too. Oh, oh. I was saying hi. To DFW you. in the house. Um. Yeah. So, but you know what? I will say, uh, flippers really are annoying. Um. We had two of those flipper guys that were outside of Barnes with me, and I had this other uh girl who was super nice, and we started talking, and we were kind of talking mess about flippers in front of a bunch of flippers, just because. But when we were able to get stuff that they weren't able to get, it's kind of like it reinvigorates you a little bit, I think. It's like it's like justice almost. Like you feel like a like, you know. Oh yeah. It's like yeah. it's like that like you get that high again, that rush of like <laughs> yeah. anyway, somebody says chases are not no, even, what is whoa, happening? Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait an hour. Okay. Why is it gonna shut down? It was a like update. Chases are not worth the time to wait outside for a storm anymore. I completely yes. agree. The one in six does it. Uh, I just bought a one and six chase for like five bucks the other day. And I bought another one for nine just because, you know, they're, they don't really have their value, yeah. but I still do like some of the alternate paint jobs. That's why I get them, but I don't really go out of my way to get them unless the they're super cool. I, I think they do need to come back with the one in 36s for sure. Yeah, I mean, come on. But then, yeah, a whole different thing. Um, let's see. What is, what does Josh say? <laughs> <laughs> uh, don't read it out loud. <laughs> huh. Interesting. No Anyways, comment. Uh, no comment. Um, <laughs> that kind of rattled us a little bit. <laughs> Daisy. <laughs> okay. Sorry. I felt the cold wet nose in my foot and my dog is laying underneath me. I um, see. I sold all my Star Wars and Marvel Pops, cut down hardcore LOL. What are you collecting now? Yeah. yeah what, you... what time is it in Texas? Where we are, it is 11.57 p.m. I mean, 10.57 p.m. Man, you need to get more sleep. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Well, somebody woke me up at 4 o'clock in the morning. Yes, Antonio, AJ. I know you have the Ace Ventura uh, pop. Will you sell it to me? I'll give you 50 bucks right Antonio, now. Antonio, AJ. Zero. You really got to stop doing that. <laughs> Man, we've already been talking for 43 minutes. I thought our videos are only supposed to last 10 minutes. <laughs> Are we talking too much, you guys? Are we, yeah, are we talking too much? Yeah, we don't really know much about these live streams. We usually just have a, a very to-the-point show. And our chat just disappeared again. Yeah, so... We'll wait for it to come back on. Do, 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 Let's see, do. we talked about Hot Toys. We talked about um So I flippers. guess it's a yes. I don't know. Oh, maybe. We what? talked. What's your grails you're looking for? Anyways, we talked about what? It's so hard. There's too many things going grails, on. Grails, uh, Red Skull. It's 2 p.m. here. Oh, we appreciate you watching. Yeah, 2 p.m. That's like in the afternoon. Uh, yeah, that's crazy. Mopar Maniac. Now that's what I'm talking about. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. 
Yeah, you want to see my collection of Mopars? We'll, we'll, we'll have a video then. Do more live streams. Well, um, if we can come out with like good ideas for live streams, sure. It's a lot easier than having to put work into editing. <laughs> hey! <laughs> oh, I'm so tired of editing. <laughs> Just get on here and talk. Y'all are stuck listening. Well, you're not stuck but listening. But for the uh, actually, we have our schedule lined up for videos that we are planning to put out for the next uh, couple of months. So we should be pretty regular. We had kind of a little rough patch where we got really busy and had to take care of a lot of things. So we weren't on a regular schedule. We're going to try to put out two to three videos a week from now on. Hopefully that'll happen, but we'll see. I know we already shot a few episodes and I am editing them. Not right now because I'm live streaming and this is live. But we will have them out. So go ahead, check us out. Always help us out. Give us follows, likes. Uh, we do this for the people that watch us and because we love collecting. Trust me, this does not. <laughs> this is a lot of work, and our only payoff for this really is the the fans and it's friends that, that we have made. It's totally um, true, though. Um, so definitely shouts out to Robert because he's probably not even awake right now. And then also AJ, Antonio, everybody that's been with us from the beginning and have just joined us now. We appreciate you. Don't we do this because we are collectors and we love it and we love you guys. Aww, oh. yeah. Don't explode. I'll try Hi, from Lafayette, Indiana. Well, that was a total curveball because you were like Lafayette and I was like, oh, Louisiana and then Indiana. And I was like, wait, what? Okay. Uh, Anthony was asking what I thought about this. I like it. I like the body. I think the head sculpt should look a little fiercer, a little bit more Oh like my that. gosh. But I like it. Yes. Um, man, I was like trying to think about questions, like answering questions. And I Chicago. I'm so tired. I didn't right know now. you're from Chicago. Okay, cool. Uh, hey, it's me. Patrick. And Patrick. Uh, the jacuzzi in Houston. I remember you. <laughs> yeah. How's it going, buddy? Yeah. I forgot about that. Red Hood looks like a tomato. Yes. Yes, actually. Put the little green thing right there, and you got tomato. Aww. Nice little tomato pop. Or look, I can. I'm a. I got a clown nose now. Okay, everybody is like, show us a collection. Maybe one day we'll get it all in one room and just. Do, do you like, really a want a collection tour. video? Because that's a lot of work. How about we do that one time? How about we organize a room someday, and then we'll just do like a live walk around tour. So it's no editing, and you can just pan everything. Because <laughs> that sounds obtainable. You need right the, now, the custom Sonic. You right see? now, we have stuff in like. Four different rooms. Maybe? Shiny. So there's like so much. Oh, that's what I was gonna answer. Somebody asked how old we are. I was just gonna tell them old. Old enough. <laughs> old. Old enough. Archaic. Attack of the Killer Tomatoes. Do more live stream and join Jetta. Oh, Glenn, what's Monday. up? Oh, Neck and Ninja Turtle. Neck and always does an excellent job. I mean, they they. They look really, so they need to get good. more love. I mean, there's so many. I mean, we actually collect a lot more than uh, Funko Pops. I mean, we do Neko, we do uh, 112 figures, uh, Hot Toys. We our friend does them. There's a few that I might get. We collect a lot of statues, posters, Mondo posters, uh, DVDs, Legos. I mean, we do a lot of stuff, but we only show a little bit on the show when we focus mainly on Funko Pops because. That's, you know, our, our main one that we've been doing for quite a while. But we love all sorts of geekdom. What was that? I, a question just... Let's see. Mm. Oh. The best pop was the Maybe Mark 1 Iron Man. I Actually, yes, that one is pretty awesome. I was so excited about it. He looks pretty cool. Old enough to party. Yeah, you're right about that. Um, I'll stab the box again. Are you guys a couple? Yes, we are a couple of collectors. <laughs> you see what I did there? Oh, uh, do more than pops on the channel. Yeah, he, this guy looks pretty good. He does. Now, I will say, when I first pulled him out to do uh, closer like shots of him, his the spring in his head was very offset. But with these bobbleheads, it's kind of to be expected. Um, so I just twisted him back around and got him looking straight again. But he does look pretty cool. I like that his helmet is all dinged up. I think they did a really good job with that. I liked all the dimples. Dimples. Any hints for the giveaway? We've actually started buying stuff for the giveaway, haven't we? We did start buying stuff. Now I'm trying to remember. It will have some Kingdom Hearts. Maybe a custom. Hey, how did maybe we not a, say Kingdom Hearts when they were asking what we're excited about? Oh yeah, maybe a custom pop. I don't know if I can find if I do any gaming custom pops, maybe. I'll throw those in there, but I really don't have any hints per se, but we'll see. Yeah. 
again with the knife. You're killing people so, there. <laughs> no. So if you watched like one of our recent videos, we had these guys on there, which are not Funko Pops. Did you see They're the super, PS4 Spider-Man awesome. Blair vs. Pops? Yes, they look nice. I just had them by my feet, so... No, okay, I have a really good method for how I open these Oh, Oscar, because... you're too kind. What? Thank you for the hard work. We love you. Hey, that's awesome. Hey. Your, your huh? love is for the low, low price. <laughs> it's yeah, easy, it's easy to buy my love. I'm overpaying. Golly, what did I spend today on your pops? Mario Funko Pops. Are we excited about Mario Funko? It, it really sees... I Got to see them. Hold on. There's some pops that aren't relatable. For instance, uh, South Park. I d am not a fan of the South Park pops. They don't really translate well into the pop world. But on the other hand, uh, the Yu-Gi-Oh pops look pretty cool, especially, uh, yeah, I mean, some of them look really cool. Pokemon, I want to see more of those. Pikachu, he looks okay. Or she, he, she, he, uh, Pikachu looks okay. So we will see. Um uh, Yes, I am excited that Funko got a Nintendo license. I think we were, like, uh, kind of touching on that. But I do think there's a lot of those characters that will translate really well, and I would love to see. Smash Brothers would be awesome. Like, some characters, pull some characters from that. I would love to see just some classic Nintendo. I mean, they've been doing all these 8-bit pops that I would love to see, like, some 8-bit stuff, and then I'd love to see some, like, you know, just regular stuff as well. Let's see. Jiminy Crazy. Too much stuff. Did you see the Coralide Pops? Yes, and they look absolutely amazing. Like, these are, like, a new level of Pops. Like, the detail in them, they look super great. From just the pictures that I've seen, I would love to see them in person. But from what I saw, they looked pretty bitching, if you will. Okay, I'm going to address this right now. No, somebody said that my method of opening Pops. I'll show you. I do not stab the box. Bear with me. You could use a butter knife. This thing is, like, super dull. Like, it's not going to cut anything. It's, like, really dull. No, um, yeah, I don't, what, what I don't do that. This thing? But you can use a butter knife. You can also use, yeah. like, a credit card. And I basically just slide it in, put pressure, and twist up. And it actually is a very simple. way to open It literally, it doesn't tear it. It doesn't leave any creases. It just looks more intimidating than it is. It works really well. Dull blade, butter knife. Would work perfect. Why is there not an 8-bit Mega Man yet? Uh, they don't have them. Yeah, they have the purple. Oh, well, yeah, they have the blue one and the purple one. Yeah, they have a lot of eight big Mega Man's. Okay. Uh, exclusive ones. Let's see. Cincy uh -huh. Nerd heading back to Texas area competition for pops. Cincy Nerd, what's up, buddy? No, he's not on here. I think oh. somebody. I think. I what? think somebody was just talking about him. Oh, Cincy Nerd's cool. <laughs> 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 I can't. Remember. Random <laughs> quote of the day. Random, random quote. Okay. Uh, Zelda pops. Yes, we need those. We yes, I would love to see. Okay, I would love to see like the original Ape at Zelda Pop, and then I'd love to see like some of the newer stuff, and maybe some like Ocarina of Time stuff type uh, style because yeah, sure. that's like one of my favorite Zelda styles, actually. All right, so I, the chat just dis disappeared, but somebody asked if we had any trouble getting pops today. No, because we woke up really <laughs> early and waited and waited and waited. Yes. So we got everything we wanted. Well, except for the stuff that we're going to try for online. Oop, sorry, guys. I just shook the whole camera. <laughs> All right. Um, best way to fix creases on your boxes. Ironing, Ironing board, but it's a very specific technique. You just got to be careful. Make sure that you don't crinkle it even more. You and put something, nice on, smooth surface, put something on top. A cloth on top. Like a cloth or a t-shirt or a really like light towel so you're not directly applying heat. Also, don't do it on plastic. Don't try it too much on plastic. Uh, what? When are you people going to do a giveaway? We're doing a giveaway right Like, our giveaway is going on right now for games. Uh, so check that out. Yeah, we have a gaming one we going do, on right now. Now we're doing bi-monthly giveaways where we just go out and we buy a whole bunch Ooh, of stuff or sorry, create baby. stuff that we want to put in the box. And it's our way of giving back to uh, the people that watch our show. So. Yeah, so definitely we decided to, because we were doing giveaways every month. And the month would kind of end and we just didn't have enough stuff that we thought was like an awesome giveaway. Like people would be super stoked for. Um, so we just decided, hey, if we do it two months, we can put more time into it, but we can put more money into it. Uh, so hopefully you guys like that. I know raffle copter isn't the best way to do it, but it is way easier on us to actually keep up with entries and pick a winner than any other method than we found. So Tony, I see your comments. There will always be a link in our video, um, in our video description. We have a dislike giveaway. <laughs> Somebody said we have a dislike. <laughs> oh well. Uh, Maybe they just accidentally hit the wrong button. Where is Thad Digby? 
Digby es, es aquí. No, no <laughs> aquí. Digby is here. No aquí. Um, yeah, we see him every day. We work with him. We can't get enough of him, but he just has a hard time making it out here. So we'll have to make sure that we get him in a, on a couple more videos soon. We just gotta, we have to like bribe him with like food and stuff just to get Good. him to come over to the house. Uh, people are funny. Tony is being savage. He's being, yes, he's a very. So Tony, it's, it's troll Tony, trolly Tony. Trolly Tony. Oh, trolly Tony. Uh, come to Boston though. Wait, what? Boston. Oh, I think they're yeah. come to Boston, tough guy. Wow. How am I a tough guy? I don't know if he's talking yeah. to you. Are you? Are you talking to me? Are you talking to me? You do, hey, you, we were just in Boston, actually. Actually, yeah, I, I like Boston. Well, like almost a year ago. <laughs> yeah, we were in Boston. Uh, okay, let's see. We are gonna wrap this up. Hey guys, just found your channel. Oh, welcome, Polly P. Welcome. Glad Welcome. you found us. Thank you. Hopefully you enjoy what we put up. Did we guys, did we get the cosmic captain crunch Funko from the Funko shop? Absolutely not. not. That thing went so quickly. I was like, Pew! done. Oh. Yeah. Funko shop, man, Funko shop exclusives. They're just tough to get. Although sometimes, sometimes we've lucked out. I got you a couple things. Somebody wants there. me to do my Keanu impression. All right. They killed my house. Okay, that's all you're getting. Whoa. Uh, Can you say I know Kung Fu? I know Kung Fu. That's, oh, my that's, God, it was perfect. That, yeah. Uh, okay, let's see. We're about to wrap this up. Taking a few more questions. Yeah, we'll just go to an hour exactly. I thought you kept Digby in a pop protector. We need to. We, <laughs> we need him in one of those pop stacks. Good thick ones so he can't get out. Um, okay, so how about that? We'll end at an hour. Thank you, Alex. We're at 55. 55 minutes. We got five minutes no, left. No, you are terrible at math. We have four Evan, minutes. Evan Campbell, how do I start collecting hot toys? They are so expensive. Yes, they are so expensive. My Stop eating, and then maybe you can afford it. Okay, my actual advice to you, uh, somebody mentioned in the comments earlier, they actually do have payment plans, oh, and yeah. that's the best way to go about it. Uh, basically, you have to pay like 20% down, down, and then it's a monthly payment. Uh, and my advice, if there's one that you really, really like, just go and do your payment plan and, and get it. That's what I'm thinking of doing with the uh, Arkham uh, Deathstroke. Yeah. Because that's one that I absolutely love and I might actually go out and buy. Also, too, a lot of times their website, if you like sign up for email or you do this, they'll give you coupons. So keep a lookout for that because a lot of times they'll do, I mean, not a ton off, but they'll do, yoga. they'll do little coupons that you can use as well. Down payment on a toy. Yes, it's a collectible figure. <laughs> Um, sideshow. Yeah, sideshow dot. Uh, side. Hey, you keep on coming on, interrupting. This is like. Yeah. Okay. Uh, last couple of questions. Did you see the new PS4 Spider-Man game reverse pops? Yes, and they are fire. They look. They do look <laughs> great. Uh, LOL. Payment plans are for the poor. Worst looking pop. Mm -hmm. Worst looking pop. Oh, Ooh, there's a bunch of them. There's okay, that was a comment that I was reading. Payment plans are for the poor. Um, that's your opinion, buddy. I think payment plans are very helpful. Yeah. Very, very helpful. Uh, we don't judge. They crunched my wick. Yes, they did. <laughs> Answer <laughs> did his somebody... Spider Man's game reverse <laughs> question. Did somebody say that? Oh my gosh. Yeah, so this, this... That's like one of my that's like one of my favorite things that uh, that we've done is the whole like wick thing. Sell me your classic car, Joey. Which one? More live streams. So, oh, sorry. Are you ever going to SDCC? As soon as we can afford it, we'll be there. Right? Yeah, as soon as we can afford it. Right now, we're poor because we have to uh, buy our toys with payment plans. So that's, that's what we're currently doing. <laughs> no. <laughs> um. Yes, Antonio, I do want that Sonic. So if you can pick it up for me, I will PayPal you. Thanks, buddy. Aw, somebody has a crush on Joey Wick. Can you block Tony? Uh, can we? I have no can, idea. Can we block him? Oh, he doesn't bug me. <laughs> Maybe he's bugging everybody else. <laughs> hey, tough guy, come to Texas. He's like, I'm, I'm here right now. You're in Texas? Hey, outside your door. I'll invite you to a barbecue. We can hang out. I don't really care. Barbecue? When do you barbecue? She's going to cook it. I don't care. Uh, da, 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 da. okay. Mm. Yeah, I can get them. Munch Goose, man, you are awesome. Love you, buddy. You've been with us for a long time. We appreciate it. Uh, oh, 
Yeah, you know, I don't know if I would ever go to a place like SDCC on my own because it probably would be pretty chaotic. But maybe one day. I mean, you know. Yeah. yeah. Maybe one day that, that you'll go on your own. No, I'm not going on my own. Okay, maybe one day we'll go. All right. Please block me, LOL. Well, just for that, you're not getting blocked. Yeah, we're not going to block you. Your reverse psychology is absolutely working on us. Yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> we love you, Tony, and we accept you for exactly the way you are. You dig me, Cholo Pop. <laughs> All right, we'll make it. Uh, lizard and silk. Oh, Talk I'm looking forward to those. Those are going to be great. So Walgreens exclusives are actually like pretty hit or miss with us. Like our Walgreens gets things, but they just get them late. So normally we don't get them when they first come out, but we have pretty good luck with Walgreens. So I'm really excited about those pops. I'm not going to block you, Tony. I said, I'm, I, I, that's what I said is reverse I, psychology is working. Yeah. Yeah. You're doing great. You're good entertaining job, me. I appreciate that. Uh, yeah. Tony is just a mad poor guy that doesn't get love. Hey, Tony, I'm sending you Target is the devil. all the love. I will say I am. Target actually, is the devil. I am actually um, a little bit pleasantly surprised with how our Target is changing things, though, because we have. Brad Campbell, had, what's up, buddy? We've had some pretty good luck with Target lately because now they're putting things in the electronics section behind their little like checkout desks. So you have to actually go ask for the pops instead of just being able, because we've even found some like target exclusives that people had like hidden behind things. Like we were looking for something and are there's you, just like a random exclusive. Oh, you found them? I, didn't, I thought I hit them better than that. <laughs> I'm just joking. All right. As soon as our chat comes back up, we are about to sign off. Are you going to, he's going to get the invisible man Funko pop. Yes. Uh, can, no, 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 no. I think Campbell been subscribed for a long time. Will you have a fan meetup? Well, we do try to travel as much as we can. Unfortunately, it's mostly in Texas, like to the different Texas cons. But I mean, you're always more than welcome to let us know like different stuff like that. You know, we, we really want, we'd love to make a trip to like the Funko headquarters and get to do that. What? Um, sometime soon. Oh yeah, so. we are going to do that sometime soon. We'll let people know ahead of time in case they want to come out and hang out with us at Funko HQ. If you ever make it to Texas though, like, yeah, if you make it to any of the Texas cons, let us know. Yeah, we will be there. Okay, a couple more questions. What Q-Fig do you want to see made next? A lot of them. Oh, so many. I We actually love Q-Figs and they are designed so well. I would love to see a spider Gwen. I really like the Spider-Man one a lot. I would love to see a Maybe Gwenpool. Gwenpool would be nice. That'd be good. Anything with Gwen in it? Anything, no, um, anything Gambit, Wolverine, Holy. Oh, get into the I would love to see X Men, Gambit, Rogue, Nightcrawler. Oh my God! Please make Nightcrawler. Like I would love that. Yeah, mm. so many different ones. All How can right. I contact you guys? Just send us a message on any of our social media. When will you make a Negan Jones pop? Uh, that's actually a good idea. That's actually not a bad idea at all. All you have to do is just swap heads. <laughs> I'd, I'd be a little bit more creative. Sure. Maybe, maybe. All you have to do is swap heads. All right. Somebody wants to smoke smoke me a kipper. Animaniacs Q-Fig. I think that they might be heading in that direction, though, because we already have Pinky in the Brain, and then we have the little pigeons that they just came out with, which should look great. Awesome. So I, I'm kind of thinking Animaniacs might be in the not-too-distant. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Awesome unboxings. Got the Asuka pop from target our target's supposed to get them in tomorrow i don't know if we're gonna be able to make it because we do have to go to work so that means we do have to sign off soon I'm planning my trip to texas now yay <laughs> we're in the houston area texas is huge don't go to like el paso or something we're nowhere near that but yeah they do have the good feather pops don't they i mean the q fig yeah god all right thank you michael uh talk i walk and i i don't know what that says I need some Captain Planet pops. Yes. I need a Don Cheadle Captain Planet pop. Oh, good That's... night, Antonio. All right, guys. Antonio's leaving, so that means that we have to shut down. Yes, this everybody live blame stream. Antonio. It's all blame his fault. Blame Antonio. All right, guys. Well, this was a lot of fun. We love talking and chatting with you, taking your questions. We are thinking about doing this more regularly because this is actually a lot of fun for us. And we even love, you know, especially Tony. Thank you for all your positive, wonderful comments. We love you. Actually, we love all you guys for coming out. Uh, yeah. Got anything to say? Uh, so one quick, I'm um, from El Paso. Have you guys been? I've never actually stopped in El Paso, but I've been through El Paso-ish. Thank you, Lance. On my way out. It's just from where we live, it's about 13 hours, 12, 13 hours. Yeah. So it's, yeah. Unfortunately, no. <laughs> we used to have a friend that lived in El Paso, though. Damn you, Tony. You so had thanks. one job. <laughs>
<laughs> All right, guys. Good night. Hope you have a wonderful night. Um, yeah. Yeah. All the Texas social media huge. stuff, <laughs> Facebook, Instagram, yeah. Twitter. Uh, Thank you, Cleveland, Ohio. All right. Now you got to click on the end stream. All right. I'm going to time this perfectly. I have, to, I have to do this. Yeah. You click so it. Because I'm going to say, well, that's it for now. Keep it popping, people. Bye, guys. Oh, no. <laughs> it asked me again. Yeah. Four new subscribers.